Okay, <clears throat> we're gonna do the three leaf clover out of one ponytail this morning. I've had quite a few people email in and request the video because it's kind of hard to tell from the pictures. So you begin by just parting their hair whichever side, pulling it back into a tight ponytail, which I've already done. And for this one, I would recommend wetting the ponytail down with water. Just it's going to be easier to keep the hairs together. So you take the ponytail after it's wet, and you're going to just divide it into three sections. Just try to get them even. This is where a rat tail comb comes in handy. If you don't have one, I love mine. Okay, will you hold this, please? So now I've got my three sections, and at this point, <clears throat> if you need to wet it down again, I would, or um, I would absolutely put in pomade. It doesn't matter to me what kind of pomade you use, but just make sure you get the pomade in there really good so the hair is pretty slick, and the hair, it's going to just stay together more like this. You know, you can see it just has a stiffer little look to it. This will help immensely on the hearts. So just put your pomade in. And then you're going to get some orthodontic elastics. And you're going to put them in about an inch, inch and a half above that big ponytail. I'm just going to do it twice so it's loose. And some more. Okay, so now you have your three sections. Each of them have a little elastic. I gotta rinse my hands off, they're slick. Okay, now to form the heart, what you're going to do is to take this section of hair, divide it into two. It's quite even. And then you're going to twist out, which is away from, away from you, I guess is what I should say. Twist towards her head, and that is going to help that hair just kind of form that little heart shape naturally. So you can see you have the little heart shape to it. And since you, I don't have six hands, at this point I add another rubber band. I'm going to retwist that. Will you reach back for me? This is the only part I have a little bit of a hard time with, just right there. Just making sure that heart, does, heart doesn't lose its shape while I put this second rubber band in. So if you want, you can have her just reach back and kind of hang on to it. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, so there's one. Grab my other rubber bands. And then you just do it again on each side. We reach back, babe. Hang on to it right there. Yep. Thank you. And don't worry about them <clears throat> just yet. If they're starting to fall like that, it's okay because we're going to play with them in just a minute. Get the last heart. Okay, reach back and hang on to that one. Right there. Okay, so now you're going to take basically where those three elastics join and you're going to put a bigger elastic in to hold the whole ponytail together. And like I said, you can fidget with the hearts after you do this, so. Okay, and then you can see that your little clover <clears throat> shape is developing right there and then if just for security if you want to stick some bobby pins in you can especially on this little top one I think that 
tends to fall forward a little. And there you go, you have your clover. And then you can add a green, a green ribbon to put in right there too. And that will also help hold it up a little. And then it will make it even look more St. Patrick's-y.